In one of my previous videos, we looked at the weakest Ryzen 3 available on the market. And as you may expect, it didn't really shine. Today, we are going one step up on the Ryzen ladder, with the weakest Ryzen 5 available on the market, the Ryzen 5 1400. Released almost 8 years ago, it was a nice way of entering the AM4 platform on the budget. And with its 4 cores and 8 threads, it seemed much more future-proof than the Ryzen 3. But how much future-proof was it exactly? Does it even stand a chance in today's gaming landscape? Let's find that out while pairing it with my RTX 3060 and a cheap A320 board, and putting it up against some seriously demanding titles of recent times. So without wasting any more time, here are the benchmarks. I'm not quite sure what to say about the overall performance of this chip, it handled some titles reasonably well, although, in most of them, percentile figures were quite terrible. 
The 8 threads certainly help out here, but the overall power of this CPU just doesn't seem to cut it anymore, to deliver a stable experience. So in conclusion, I would definitely search for a better alternative to the Ryzen 5 1400, and with sites like AliExpress full of cheap options, getting one of these isn't really justifiable in any way. So now with the weakest Ryzen 3 and 5 tested, I hope to get my hands on the Ryzen 7 1700 to see whether or not that's still a viable option in 2025.